Hello YouTube, it is Adam Moore in Sing Gaming 2010 coming at you with yet another Gemini Jets scale 1 to 200 model review and unboxing. And this is of a Boeing 757-200 with winglets in the Delta Airlines Sky Team livery. So this is the box. You've got your typical Gemini 200 box. It's normally like this. You've got Gemini. You've got the Delta logo, you've got Sky Team, and then you've got the actual picture of the plane. It is quite realistic, except for in real life, the plane is more silver than this picture. Then you've got 1 to 200 scale die cast airplane model, aircraft model. So, the box is quite worn down here, but I guess because I got it um, used, that is. So it's a single button, so I just open this up, and here you go, um, I guess the model wasn't put in place all the way, but take this out, this is typical on all Gemini models. And here is the actual aircraft, so I'm just going to set this down here on the box, so one second while I do that. And here you go, so here is the actual aircraft. So let's get to some of the details. First off, you start off with your uh, typical. You got your typical uh, cockpit windows, and that's pretty um, good for detail. Then you've got Sky Team Delta, and the front door. And I'm sorry, you probably can't see. The reason why is because the light hits the silver and it makes it so that the details don't show up too well whenever you're filming. So unfortunately, you can't get too close with too good with the details on this model or well, for zooming in. But here's the here's an example. Sorry, let it focus, but there's an example of the door. Oh, and this is good cuz now I can zoom the whole thing. But anyway, going back, so this would typically be your first class. You've got Delta Sky Team um, then you've got the, this would most likely be business from, like, here to there. No, wait, no, from, like, right there, from, like, the beginning, to probably halfway through, and then you have a cutoff and the rest. From here, most likely, is economy, but I'm not sure because different 757s have different layouts. So, anyway, you keep on going back, you've got the winglets. And then you've got the registration, November 717, uh, what is that, T, um, I forget what T is, I know it, but W's Whiskey, so, oh no, T's Tango, sorry, Tango Whiskey, sorry about that. Um, so then you keep on going back, you have the American flag. And then you've got the back door. It is a four-door aircraft. And uh, and, uh, and then you have, sorry, you have the tail. And this is, I think, kind of bland. You just have Sky Team and then their logo. And all the details are there. Um, and it is really, really nice. Um, the landing gear does pivot. Unlike my CRJ 900, and uh, I'm not really sure why different planes pivot uh, for the landing gear and some not don't. But um, here are some of the antennas. There's only really one on the top. You uh, see that red one? That's the beacon light. And then um, I'm probably going to uh, do a uh, yeah. I'm showing the underbelly right now. And I'm going to have videos coming up after my trip to England. So I'm probably going to have, well, I'm definitely having four takeoffs. And then, well, really eight videos for you, guaranteed. And I've already booked my uh, seats on the 747 coming back. And on the 777 coming back, so I'm on the wing. So I can guarantee that. And then the American 7, uh, ERJ 145 is such a small aircraft, I'm guaranteeing that I will have a somewhat decent seat. So, um, 
that's what the underbelly looks like from the front turn to the back you you got some more um stuff so um and then you have I'm just going to show you guys some views of the aircraft um for you people who are interested in buying it um the cost of this model is 50 some dollars you can uh, normally with shipping get it for 70 but I got it on eBay for 51 so it just depends I would wait out um until they re-release their um new livery here's the thing f here's the view from the top let it focus sorry about that and there you go so that's basically it um make sure to subscribe to my channel and keep on watching my videos i love it when people watch my videos and my goal is to get a hundred and eighty thousand views by this time next year so if that sounds ambitious um... my view my uh... channel has gone from about twenty five thousand views to forty two thousand views in about two and a half months so that's real good and i started off like really slowly building up to 15,000 and since 15,000 I really have started to chug along and get thousands of views every couple of weeks so um, make sure to check out Lone Warrior 6's channel and he has never spoken to me he seems like a sort of nice kid but he has many really good model reviews and I really do follow his channel and I hope to uh, get as many views on uh, a couple of my videos as he does and um that would be uh that basically wraps it up for now guys um thanks for watching this video would i recommend buying it yes but it would not be my first option uh so thanks for watching again guys and uh fly safe peace